who are these monsters I remember writing in my journal? I mean, Joel's heart was ripped open. It was, like, ripped open. They shredded my boy's heart. And then a couple of days later, I went into my journal and I wrote, We're not looking for monsters. We're looking for the young people. We're looking for human beings. If I think of them as monsters, I let them off the hook. If I hold them in their humanity, then I hold them accountable. centered around the death of somebody and it blows my mind revenge and justice forgiveness and accountability and what do they all have to do with one another if anything I don't know I feel like revenge is my justice cause like after I got stabbed it's just like I don't know it's like damn I lost two of my friends to these people I don't want to go down just knowing I went down for being peaceful. And like, I, I can't lose another friend. <laughs> I can't. By losing my son, everything changed for me. Everything changed. So it's like me learning how to cope and deal in the aftermath. What do I do with this pain? Turn this negative around to a positive, right? I have a vision that in all neighborhoods, people will be running circles. People will be running circles to just build relationships, to build community. But people will also be circling up around those young people that they see are having a hard time. I know a lot of you do. I know a lot of you do. Mm -hmm.